The 2024 Kia Carnival is here, and it's got everybody talking. Now, we all know it's good, but what really sets the new Carnival apart from its rivals? The 2024 Kia Carnival is not just practical and comfy, but it also looks like an SUV, which is great for those of us who aren't fans of traditional minivan styling. The Carnival's design is reminiscent of Kia's popular Telluride SUV, which certainly isn't a bad thing. Though minivan competitors like the Chrysler Pacifica and the Honda Odyssey offer slightly more space, the Carnival doesn't disappoint. It boasts a low load floor and a spacious interior, perfect for everyday family needs. If you opt for the VIP seats in the second row, you're in for a treat. These seats recline and they add a touch of luxury, making family road trips with cranky kids much more enjoyable. Safety features and modern infotainment are standard across all models, which is a big plus. The only drawback might be that the Carnival is front wheel drive only. But don't worry, the 290 horsepower V6 engine, combined with winter tires, can level the playing field against all wheel drive competitors, especially in snowy conditions. For 2024, the Carnival sees updates that affect mainly the EX trim. In this mid range version, the auto up down power windows feature has been removed, while a power operated rear lift gate has been added for extra convenience engine, transmission, and performance. Under the hood, the Carnival packs a 3.5-liter V6 engine, delivering a pretty intriguing 290 horsepower. It's paired with an 8-speed automatic transmission. However, all-wheel drive isn't available for the Carnival. It's strictly a front-wheel drive model. Unlike the Pacifica with its plug-in hybrid option and the hybrid default of the Toyota Sienna, the Carnival doesn't offer such powertrain choices. What stands out is the Carnival's balanced performance. Its ride is smooth during leisurely drives and composed when taking on corners. Thanks to the refined V6 engine, acceleration is lively, propelling the Carnival from 0 to 60 in just 7 seconds. Now, this is slightly behind the Honda Odyssey's time of 6.5 seconds, but it's still rapid for a vehicle of this size. When it comes to fuel efficiency, the Carnival is rated by the EPA at 19 miles per gallon city and 26 miles per gallon highway. During comprehensive testing that included a 75 mile per hour highway route, the Carnival achieved an impressive 28 miles per gallon highway, surpassing its EPA rating by 2 miles per gallon. Interior, Comfort and Cargo Inside the Carnival, you'll find a contemporary and welcoming dashboard and front seat area. The spacious center console offers ample storage for small items. An optional dual-screen infotainment system with a digital gauge display reminiscent of Mercedes style lets you easily access the van's connectivity features. For a more luxurious touch, the upscale SX Prestige trim boasts leather upholstery and can be equipped with reclining second-row seats that even feature pop-up footrest. Known as VIP seats, they offer a comfortable way for passengers to enjoy long journeys. However, unlike rival minivans, these seats can't be removed or stowed in the floor, which affects the Carnival's maximum cargo space. If you opt for the optional panoramic sunroof, it provides a broad opening over the second row for a breath of fresh air. The Carnival truly excels in cargo space. In its eight-passenger setup, the second row bench is split into three sections, allowing them to slide independently for added flexibility. While they can be removed, finding a place to store them is necessary. The third row seats conveniently fold down flat into the floor. In terms of numbers, there's 40.2 cubic feet of space behind the third row seat. With the third row folded and the second row bench removed, the space expands to an impressive 145.1 cubic feet. These figures rank among the best in its class. While this is a substantial cargo capacity, it's worth noting that both the Pacifica and the Odyssey edged ahead slightly in terms of space. While the Carnival's exterior design might make its sliding doors seem smaller than the others, they offer just as much functional space. Notably, the driver's seat is remarkably adjustable, catering to drivers of all sizes, ensuring a comfortable driving position. The expansive windows and optional surround view camera system contribute to excellent outward visibility, helping you stay aware of your surroundings. The Carnival's interior is also designed with storage in mind, providing numerous nooks and pockets for your belongings. However, some other minivans do offer even more innovative storage solutions. If you're transporting children who require car seats or booster seats, rest assured there is ample room. However, it's worth noting that the lower seat anchors might be a bit tricky to access. On the downside, we notice that the Carnival's piano black surfaces are prone to smudges, and some of the main cabin controls lack haptic feedback, which might be less satisfying to use. Technology the Carnival boasts impressive technology offerings, with some notable highlights. The base configuration includes an 8-inch infotainment screen. Alternatively, you can go for the optional dual 12.3-inch displays that extend across two-thirds of the dashboard. One functions as a digital gauge display, while the other handles infotainment tasks. Both Apple CarPlay and Android Auto come standard. Inside the cabin, you'll find up to nine USB ports for your devices. Moving up the trim levels, the SX trim and above offer an optional rear seat entertainment system. However, the premium 12-speaker Bose stereo is exclusive to the top-tier SX Prestige trim. For those concerned about parking, 
The numerous parking cameras eliminate any uncertainty. Remarkably, many of these tech features come at a more affordable price compared to competitors. However, not everything shines as brightly as it may seem on paper. While the bevy of features is present, the voice control system isn't as intuitive or helpful as other systems we've encountered. Additionally, the lane keeping and traffic adaptive cruise control systems can feel more like obstacles than aids. Safety features Kia equips the Carnival with a range of standard driver assistance features, such as lane keeping assist, automatic high beam headlamps, and blind spot monitoring. These features elevate the Carnival's competitiveness in comparison to rivals like the Pacifica, Sienna, and the Honda Odyssey. Notable safety elements include standard automated emergency braking with pedestrian detection, standard lane departure warning with lane keeping assist, available adaptive cruise control, price. Kia remains committed to delivering vehicles that excel in value. The Carnival, with an attractive starting price in the low 30s, stands as a compelling option. As you progress through its trim levels, you'll discover each upgrade brings a unique feature that might be absent from competitors or offered at a pricier tier. The Carnival has much more to offer at the price. Craftsmanship shines through with solid build quality and impressive interior materials. The Carnival boasts a comfortable ride that manages to strike a balance between comfort and control, ensuring a smooth driving experience without compromising on handling. Inside, the vehicle shines, with its advanced interior technology and well-thought-out storage solutions catering to modern needs. From the spacious cabin to the abundance of USB ports and innovative compartments, the Carnival excels at accommodating both passengers and their belongings. Furthermore, the Carnival's strong suit is its impressive feature per dollar value, providing a range of tech, safety, and comfort features at a competitive price point. While the Carnival has much to offer, there are a few drawbacks to consider. Firstly, the absence of hybrid or all-wheel drive options might limit the choices for those seeking fuel efficiency or enhanced traction in various conditions. Additionally, the V6 engine, while capable, can become somewhat noisy under heavier loads, potentially impacting the overall driving experience. The presence of touch buttons, although modern in appearance, might not offer the tactile feedback and responsiveness that traditional physical buttons provide, potentially leading to usability concerns for some users. Warranty and Maintenance Coverage Kia takes the lead in the warranty department, outshining its competitors with a robust powertrain policy extending over 10 years or 100,000 miles. However, unlike the Sienna, the Carnival lacks complementary scheduled maintenance. The coverage breakdown includes limited warranty lasting for 5 years or 60,000 miles, powertrain warranty offering protection for 10 years or 100,000 miles, and no provision for complementary scheduled maintenance. Our preference leans towards the EX trim. This variant brings together a wealth of practical features that enhance the driving experience, such as heated seats, a larger touchscreen, wireless phone charging, and added safety systems. It strikes a balance by offering these valuable additions without the higher costs associated with the SX trims and their more luxurious offerings.